Everybody gangsta until Patrick CC turned the red lights on. It's rap songs carried by the feature. Drink water. Lua Lua actually made this video, rap songs ruined by the feature versus carried by the feature. And I'm gonna give my opinion on it. Make sure you comment down below some rap songs that you think were carried or ruined by the feature. Bro, this song has a billion views, so like it doesn't even matter. It's funny that the song is called Unforgettable. He's like the most forgettable artist ever, dude. Oh, Sway Lee killed that, but yeah, French Montana, you got carried on your own song. You hate to see it. Ice water turn Atlantic. Night calling in a phantom. Told them hold it, don't you panic. Took an island, fled the mansion. Pull up in a demon on guard. Looking like I still do fraud. Flying private jet with the rod. No. Nope. No. <laughs> Nah, bro. Kodak didn't get carried. I'm sorry. Today's video is sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. Are you looking for an immersive fantasy RPG game with high quality graphics? Raid Shadow Legends is a turn-based MMORPG where you assemble a squad of powerful champions and fight for glory. The best part is, it's entirely free and available on mobile and PC for you to play. Use my links below to download Raid for yourself. There are 16 different factions to choose from, including Orcs, Barbarians, and Undead Hordes. I have chosen to focus on Undead Hordes. One thing I love about this faction is the art style. Just look at the legendary Crypt King Grawl with his geometric sorcery. Come on, he just looks awesome. Or look at the Bone Knight rare attack character. The detail in the armor and weapons really shows the impressive graphics. Overall, I'm very impressed with the look of the champions. Assemble a squad and compete in ongoing tournaments or compete against the entire raid community while fighting the Spider's Den, Ice Golem's Peak, the Almighty Fire Knight, or the Notorious Dragon in order to win some awesome rewards and rare artifacts. You can find me in the game under Patrick CC, and if you act quickly, you can join my clan. Water Gang. What are you waiting for? Go to the video description, click the special links, and if you're a new player, you'll get 200,000 silver plus one free champion, Tree Feller. An awesome champion, great for new players. All this new treasure will be waiting for you here. Act quickly because these rewards will only be available for the next 30 days and only for new players. Good luck. I'll see you there. I will say, I do think that Travis Scott did have the best verse on this track. However, I think Kodak pulled his weight and I understand, but I disagree. And I'm just gonna leave it at that. Nine on one, Shelby Drive, look alive, look alive. Niggas came up on this side, now they on the other side. My weapon be the instrument, I blow you like a flute. Nigga, 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 play so you feel it. Pull, pull up, broad day with the K9 shiver. <laughs> Bro, this is a tough one, cause Drake did just kill that. Oh man, and Drake is just like, you know what I mean? He's a legend and then fucking Blockboy JB literally had such a brief moment. I saw Blockboy open up for Trippy. Half of his set was dancing to other people's songs. So I think that says enough, bro. He got carried. Future? Ruined by the feature? Shorty like a thousand dollar plate, fine china Tell her that she beautiful every day, I remind her and I jump in a pussy like a lake, I'm a diver And the last man was a pussy hat or vagina I get lost in her eyes like dust from the sky I'm going to Mars call your ex I'm going to Zeta with my girl I'm feeling like I'm running out of space You need to sing your location, I can't think I done fell in love twice, but I got a beat line Cause I'm living 10 lives, I go crazy about mine No I'm a back of my <laughs> no. Future didn't ruin the song. It's good. It's it's perfectly fine. I mean, this song as a whole, I don't think is really my cup of tea. But no, Future didn't ruin it. How you look so perfect on your worst days Double C it purses, you deserve it Niggas in your DM, they be thirsty And in person, but you're curving Curvy little body, love your surface yeah. I'm alone, your body make you nervous I'm in the V with the tents Got the effing on my body in the clip with hollow tents Niggas said they go around me and they still ain't do shit Catch a waiting in the lobby and I'ma give it his dick Man, where these niggas at? Man, where these niggas at? We gon' pull up big bodies with the rookas in the back Yeah, 
<laughs> yeah, definitely 6 9 ruined that song. And I'm not even like the world's like biggest 6 9 hater. I mean, obviously. You know, A Boogie's just like, like it's all smooth. And you're like, ooh, okay. And then 6 9 comes in and he's like, ah, 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 it was that. It's like, whoa, <laughs> whoa, dude, chill the fuck out. We were just vibing. And then you come in, just fucking ah, hold up, dude. Yeah, fucked it up, dude. 6 9 you're here. Just bring it down to here for the, just for this song, maybe, possibly. And after dropping off my bitch, they sit a couple shots, but I'm just glad that nigga missed. Dug down and started clapping, tried to flip that whole whip, but I'd rather take a life before my mama see me step. Dude, I never really analyzed this song, but this is honestly a pretty weird track. Like, it's honestly kind of bad when you really think about it. Young Bands, he's smooth, really chill, always has that really down energy and that's cool because he had this sort of beachy like uplifting kind of vibe but still came in like dark with the vocals but then you have like landing cube just singing in the middle of it that just Get high, yeah, on the west side, yeah. bringing it to like level 10 after Young Bands is at level one. And then Namir just comes in with like, just this flow that just doesn't match the song at all. And it's honestly just a whole mishmash of sounds and flows and shit that sounds pretty bad. I'm gonna say Young Bands is the only one that belonged on this song to begin with. I'm gonna say they both ruined the song. And uh, <laughs> yeah, man, wow, this is a weird one. <laughs> See them lames later. Can't save her. Her nigga stepped out. Now she's saying what she really think. Rolling up pounds of dank. Open accounts no matter where we get. Smoking there and back. Eyes barely open. I never smoking. I'm shining from air to air. Stand my ground. I ain't showing no fear. I done came up like the top of the stairs. These niggas hate cause they cannot compare. Aw oh, shit. I'm in the crowd with the mosh fit. I hit the stage in the show. Tits. I'm in the game. I can't forfeit. Honestly, I'ma make more hits. He said Lil Skies carried that? Hell no. <laughs> I'm gonna say the total opposite. Wiz carried Skies on that, bro. And I got respect for Skies, but his verse was so mid. What? I'm gonna say absolutely when you ask him, I'm in love, I want to watch. I need a chick that I could cherish, who I can only come on. Let's take a journey. If they catch me lacking, then the world gon' think less of me. If God don't ask it right away, I know he got to test me. My perspective change. I think I'm gonna disagree. I don't think that there really was a part in this song that really shined too much. I think Polo G, I was gonna say that he had the better verse, but he didn't really change up the flow too much. I actually think that it's a well-made song. Like, I don't think that one outshined the other. I in this bitch, I know they gonna shoot shit up. And my little brother turned to a drummer, walking my side, now he got the lump. I said that made bag where the gays at, tell my brothers about a hundred summers. All my niggas know, run up them numbers. Fuck, run up them numbers. Yeah. Run up them numbers, okay, see so you don't want no thunder. The old Tracy McBady, the one, okay, see so you don't want no thunder. Yeah, Christian the sweater, okay, Christian Dio the sweater. The double dog came with the umbrella, when I put the hoodie on it, get rid of. Bro, I am biased towards New York artists, but when it comes to A Boogie, I just... I just don't really vibe with him that much for some reason. I respect him, but just, ah, and especially next to Roddy, like, there's just this different fullness and energy that, that comes with Roddy's voice. And when it's directly next to A Boogie's, oh, it sounds so much better. <laughs> Yeah, bro, I definitely think it. Yeah, I'm gonna have to agree with you there. I think Offset 100% carried this song. Honestly, there hasn't really been a Stunner for Vegas song that I like. He doesn't fill a void that I feel like we're missing. But I don't think anybody's ever told me like, yo, check out that new Stunner for Vegas. Or like, he's my favorite rapper. Yeah, he does views and I'm glad he's successful. In terms of his music, it's just, he's very standard. And I don't think that it's objectively bad. I just think that it's not that interesting or unique. I'm gonna say Stunna for Vegas. Carried all the way. She me gun and weeze and a spray of the snake. I bought me beans and came with a shake. I fuck on your friends, I fuck on your bay. Every time I pretend it come with a bait. I was in a rush, I was seeing space. Why the fuck a bitch bring my beans late? Bitch, you ain't my sin save you cause you my nut to cleanse your face. Bitch drank my nut like ENJ. I was fucked up, broke, had to reinstate. Uh-huh. 
look and see him straight, me sits and wait, got birthday cake. Uh -huh. Gotta keep an AK, these niggas play game like arcade. Uh -huh. Pull up in the Porsche, see you on the low, you had to part ways. Oh, bro, young thug, dude. Oh, he's so good. <laughs> bro, I wasn't even gonna listen to the song and I was gonna be like, Gunna got carried, cause like, who's gonna keep up with Thug? But actually, Gunna pulled his weight on this one. Like, all of Gunna's music, I haven't really heard much of substance. But like, this one, you could tell he was really trying to keep up with Thug, cause like, how are you gonna compete with him, you know? I'm gonna say nobody got carried. Uh-oh. J. Cole and Young Thug? J. Cole carried Young Thug? Oh, I don't know about that one, Chief. Think J. Cole carried Young Thug? Man, J. Cole is trash. No, I'm just playing. I think just my favorite thing to do is... <laughs> This on J. Cole fans. J. Cole fans get so mad when you try to undermine him. But no, I think J. Cole killed his verse. I think Young Thug killed his verse. And I think Travis did his part too. I don't think anybody got carried and I'm not even trying to be that guy. I could see what you think. Like if you love lyrical rap, um, then you'll be like, oh my God, Young Thug is so annoying. But if you just appreciate hip hop music and all of its uh, different sort of sounds, then I think you will appreciate everybody pulling their leg on this one. And um, yeah, so not carried. As you can see, my opinion on rap is different than your opinion on rap is different than that person's opinion on rap. And we all just have a bunch of opinions and either sometimes you agree with them, sometimes you don't. It doesn't really matter because that's the beauty of music. It's all, it's all just how you feel about it. It d just doesn't matter. But um, if you did agree with my opinion, then you should definitely hit the subscribe button, maybe like the video. Maybe you can even comment on the video and let me know uh, where I was right, where I was wrong. But most importantly, um, comment on the video and let me know if you uh, can think of some other songs where the rapper uh, was carried by his feature or the song was ruined by the feature. Anyways, my name is Patrick CC. Make sure you're hydrated, make sure you're drinking water. And um, that's it. Pull out the bends And I put in miles for you There's too many things To narrow it down for you You got too many friends But that wouldn't die for you